Hello there! Hey babes, it's Jamie. So, for this video, and also since it's about Thanksgiving-ish time, I thought it'd be fun to learn some etiquette and some table manners from BuzzFeed. Because you know, who else better to teach you than BuzzFeed? I wanted to react to this video forever, um, but I couldn't do it because the old recording stuff I had wouldn't record it for some reason, and for this video I'm basically stealing BuzzFeed's content, but since I don't get paid to do this, woo, no monetization is not a big deal. But seriously, this is a super funny video, and it, it's just, it's just real, it's just comedy gold. I don't know who came up with this, but it's good. And it's like super festive, so why not react to it? Alrighty, let's get started. Very nice. Very nice music. British narrator. You can't go wrong with this. Reasonable. They are nature's turd. They taste like tiny turds. This is what you do with Brussels sprouts. It is good etiquette. This is stuffing. This is stuffing. It is I like stuffing. I'm actually a stuffing fool. Stuffing because it was stuffed into the anus of a dead bird. I like stuff that's been up a dead bird's butt. A legume. A legume. Really has made a penis out of the legume. <laughs> that is bad etiquette. The word of the day today is legume. Say it with me. Legume. 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 Can we just notice the attention to detail? Not only did he make a penis out of a glue hand, he um he he made he made he made it three D by by on the cup. Attention to detail. That's an art student right there. Contrast here. Billy makes a penis on accident. That wasn't an accident. His mistake. That is good etiquette. Now it's just tiny. Now he has made a food pyramid. Billy has no friends. <laughs> his food. He is an I like how being aware of nutrition makes you have no friends. <laughs> uh. Has no friends. He has separated his food. He is an obsessive. Maybe he writes computer programs. That's smart. Here's the thing, though. Creating computer programs means you're super smart and you're very meticulous. And yes, you are very obsessive, but that's very neat looking. That's very nice. Nothing's touching each other. Have you ever met those people or kids who don't want their food touching? They're probably the smartest and richest people ever because they're very meticulous. They're very particular and make good stuff, which makes good money. Okay, let's examine this, shall we? Okay, can we assume that the cranberry sauce is blood? I think we can. Just picture you at a family gathering, bored out of your mind. What would you do with your food? Probably squish it. Probably make a penis out of a glugume and make disturbing pictures out of your thing. Therapy. He has made a nice drawing. Now that's pretty. That's Bob Ross. Now, here is the correct way of using your... This is the wrong way. This is bad etiquette. Ew. Ew. Gross. What I'm confused about is how gravy relates to sex. I mean, I get it, but at the same time I don't because it's gross to me. This video is making me want to go asexual. Alright, this is a very short, very kind of random video, but I wanted to react to this forever ago, and I thought, what a perfect time to do it. It's stupid, I'm ripping off BuzzFeed, but hey, happy holidays. If you have any suggestions of holiday videos I could do, by all means, comment them, like this video if you liked it, and if not, well, just ignore it. Hey kids, the word of the day today is legume. Say it with me. Legume. 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 Black creature from black. Black creature. Creature from the black lagoon. Legume. Eh. 